Hello everybody, my name is Sir Meowface. Today we'll be doing a first impressions video on the Rockat Myth that Rockat so generously provided for review. Um, this was supposed to be an unboxing video, but when doing some of the, the uh, preemptive opening, I tore it like an idiot. So <laughs> I thought I'd just take it out of the box and present it as it is because the box is a little torn because I'm a clumsy fool. Um, the first thing you notice about this is it's a decent size. That's one of the things I always worry the most about when picking up a new mouse is you don't, if you're ordering online, you have no clue, you know, if it's going to be slightly too big, t slightly too small. I have relatively average hands, nothing special, um, and it fits perfect. I would say if you are a, you know, average to even a little small, a little big handed, um, it's fine, honestly. Now, what really makes the Nith special is the, uh, modular buttons. Um, I've done a few mock-up reviews so far trying to get this right, and one of them, I was fumbling around foolishly trying to get these buttons out, but it's actually really simple. It just has a little switch right here, and I'm not going to do this graciously at all, because it's weird with the camera, but... But there you go. <laughs> um, which is pretty freaking awesome. You gotta admit. Because you have all these buttons you can just switch out for other buttons. Uh, which I'm going to show you. This part I haven't done, so uh, hopefully I get this right. Let's see. So you got uh, adjustable side grips. Pretty cool. You know, it's just to uh, better fit your hand. But well, let's see. Um, okay. So in here... See, I haven't done this part yet, so hopefully this is the video I, that I do this all correctly. Um, Alright, so... Oh, it's untreaded territory. This is scary. Alright, so as you see, you have plenty of new buttons to uh, switch out. Like, just for example... Uh, oh, this is where I'm going to mess it up. Okay. And then... Oh yeah, this is it. This is why you gotta practice these things. Upside down. It's upside down. That's why. And. Oh, no. No, apparently they need to be in certain slots. So let's try this. Yeah, they're numbered. See if I just paid basic attention, you can see that. That's not my crowd, it's not gonna adjust, but that's a one right there. And this is a one. Can you see that? You can't. Because I turned off autofocus. But, bam! Now it's double button. That's pretty awesome. That really allows you to uh, fine tune your controller, controller, fine tune your mouse for uh, you know MMOs, MOBAs, all that good stuff. Um, I don't really know of any other mice that do this off the top of my head. Um, I know a, a few have to, but it's a really, really rare concept, and this is executed pretty well. I mean, I'm pretty clumsy. I'm not going to lie, and this is, you know, and I'm able to figure this out rather quickly, you know. Um, there's a lot of button options. I think there's, what's this say, there are 33 buttons, which is absurd. Like, if you're someone who loves to fine-tune, um, you know, your gaming experience, I guess the best way to put it, because, you know, you can't really say fine-tune your mouse, um, this is ideal. This is crazy, because... Oh, I'm really excited, actually. This is pretty sweet, because you have so many options. Like, way more than I was expecting. Like, I don't even know how, you, how I do a proper review on this without just toying around with it. Because, look at this. This is... Oh, man. I'm actually really, uh... really stoked. I'll definitely have to do a follow-up video on having to plug in and trying it out with actual gameplay, because... You know, all I can really do is, is just show you that this is, you know, this is pretty sweet. I want to put these all back in order, aren't I? All right, let's see. Let's see if they did probably set them up, you know, to match the layout of the mouse. And they totally did. Uh, I'm not an organized person, so um, I'm going to have to keep track of these. Let's see. Um, so, yeah, this is pretty awesome. Um, besides that, the stand, I didn't push that one in far enough, 
I guess that's something you have to pay attention to. Oh, it's a lock. Yeah, okay. Well, where's that a three? Did I do this right? I feel like I did this right. Yeah, I'm just not, it's not, I, I didn't relock it. Um, it's a pretty awesome concept. Um, I really, I'm going to have to try it on MMO. I'm going to do a second video because this is, uh, this is exactly what it's designed for. And, you know, you, you could basically, with, what, 12 buttons, you could bind, like, your whole skill set. You know, you could put 12 bindable keys, or you could switch it up for, uh, you know, something like uh, League of Legends, you know. Um, yeah, I mean, it has a nice weight. Pretty standard wheel, you know. I don't know what that button does. Let's see. Um, you have the hot softball grids, modular design. It, it supports up to uh, 12k DPI with a twin tech laser sensor. Ooh, I want to try taking this off. Oh, what well, that just comes right off. That is awesome. I'll use some magnets. This is uh, a pretty uh, smart design. Wow, that, that's just fun to do. I'm already I'm enjoying that. Jeez. That's quick. They they were not kidding when they said it's a uh, it's a you know hot swap. That's like, let's see now I got I got test. Does it? No, nah, it, it doesn't like come off either. You know, like unless you want it to. That's that's pretty cool. All right. Um. Yeah. I like it. I think this. Is a, oops. I just, I just dropped one of the bits. I'll pick that up after. Yeah. As I said, I'm not the not the most graceful person. That's gonna bother me. But uh, overall, um, I think it's really, I think it's <laughs> really cool. I feel like I've kind of semi butchered this video with my fool, clumsy foolishness, but you know, I'll, uh, I think this is a, this is a good take. Um, overall, I'm pretty impressed. Let's see if there's anything else in here. I mean, let's see the the case. The case is actually, I know that's a minor detail, but it, this is a well made case. Like, it's not like some cheesy little you know thing you get out of a you know most most computer you know most computer mice boxes um this is pretty solid like that's you know i don't know if it can it can it carry your mouse or is this just meant to i think this is just meant to carry your uh you know your little modular pieces but even so you know it's a quality box and you know some people will care about that i think it's worth mentioning let's see what else what else do we got we got stickers, of course. Sweet. I'm giving a lot of them. I'm going to open these up. I know you guys didn't you didn't care about the... Uh, you probably don't care about the stickers as much, but, you know, if you're going to buy a mouse, you might as well enjoy it. Let's you might as well get to look through, so... Look at that. Ooh. And... Yeah, ooh, information. Quick installation guide. There you go. I mean, that was pretty standard. But, uh... Overall, yeah, I mean, first impressions, I'm just checking, first impressions, uh, I think it's pretty cool. I mean, I was, I, I you know, you, you go into these and you, you don't really, you know, when you're going to review a mouse, you have a general idea of what to expect, but this kind of throws you for a loop because this is really different. I'm, I was kind of, uh, kind of lost for a bit because you don't know how to, you know, start off because the it's a, it's a mouse, you know, and it's a quality mouse. And you can say that about, you know, a lot of mice, but their execution of the modular thing is really unique, and I can't really compare it. I can't say, hey, you know what, this is really cool, you should, it's just like such and such. No, this is really unique, and really exciting, like, because I'm, when it comes to things like MMOs and, you know, games of the sort where you have a lot of buttons, you know, if, if you're playing, uh, if you're doing raids or something like that, or, you know, or just playing, you know, League of Legends, um, being able to just quickly access your abilities is pretty crucial. And this is, uh, and being able to customize which ones, you know, or how you can access it, like, you know, set to one giant button, or, you know, have a bunch of little ones, or even just mix match. Um, it really allows you customize your own personal layout. So that's really cool actually um so i guess all i can say is you know this is a good job uh rocket you did a uh pretty this is pretty unique i just i love this 
That's. I just love when things just, you know, you can just quickly switch things out. That's. I'm just gonna be playing with this. I'm gonna annoy. I'm gonna annoy people with that. I can tell right now. Um. All right. I guess that is. Uh. I guess that is all. Um. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, feel uh, hit that like button and feel free to subscribe. Um, and I guess that is it. Uh, have a good, yeah.